Okay, so basically what I'm doing is I'm going to be unboxing these three boxes right here. Um, the one in the front is the pad, the one in the back is all the hardware, and the little white one that I am touching, or not touching anymore, is the knurled handle. So if you take a look at the back right here, um, you'll see on the bottom it has the manufacture date right there. It was June 18th, 2020. So that was about a month or two ago. Here are the two knurled, uh, or one knurled and one regular handlebar. Um, you can take a close up at it. I didn't think the knurled was worth it. I mean, it's cool, it's badass, but I would much rather have the smooth one. I thought it felt better and actually for sale. If anyone wants it, come and get it. <laughs> Putting these bolts in order so I can kind of get a hang of what's going on. So look at how big these bolts are. These are the uh, the monster light bolts, the five ace bolts. Okay, so this is the UDM uh, plastic that goes underneath. Basically, there's like a little uh, divot, and then you put the bolt or screw inside, and then it makes it flush. And that goes on the bottom and makes sure it doesn't scratch up uh, your flooring. One thing I will say when I was making this was that you want to make sure that these that before you tighten the bolts on the end with the single peg, push in that uh, plastic piece. Once you bolt in the sides, it's harder to get in. And actually I wasn't able to get mine in. So I'm not sure if that's something that Rogue had to deal with, but I'm gonna contact them and see what they say. Damn, this bench is heavy duty. So if you're still watching me, you'll notice that the bench is aligned a little bit too far to the left. There's two bolts on the bottom and you can have it align a little bit further uh, left or right. Um, I put it the wrong way, but I fixed it and me fixing it is in the video. 